welcome to today's video today's video is going to be an unboxing of the ninja wood wood fire pellets outside smoker <laughs> um what do they call it outdoor grill i'm sorry the outdoor grill the ninja wood fire outdoor grill i'm showing you what the box included it came with two box two bags of all-purpose blend um pellets those are the ninja brand and i show you here each item that it included in the box these items are the the little container that you put the pellets on the for the wood fire the wood the wood pellets and then that is the grease catcher under the device the cord garbage <laughs> It does the entire thing. It is heavy. I did pick up the entire thing that the box from outside inside because I did give this as a gift for my husband and I didn't want him to see and I did carry it. It is heavy um, in the box with all that. It is heavy. Um, it comes in that one entire thing. It, you don't need to assemble nothing besides putting in the little the cord, the grease catcher and the handles. That's how it looks. Please be careful. Um, please take all off all of the stickers, like the stickers on the sides, the little papers on the bottom. Make sure everything and all is completely off. That's the basket that you see inside. That's how it looks in the front. The little knob, you turn it and then you select things. It says only compatible with Ninja Wood pellets. That's what it says. It is not. That is the basket. That is paper and garbage. And that is the bottom thing. It's the grill or the, yeah, the grill. That's the one we use most of the time. I haven't actually used the basket yet. And that is the stove part. <laughs> it is recommended for you to clean it every time you use it. Uh, we did not do that. And we ended up um, having a very dirty grill. Look at how clean it should be. But yeah. Please dispose of all the papers, all the plastics, and all those little baggies that you included there. Your kids might get it and you don't want to do that. The little handles are easy to clip on. You just press on and they are on. They are plastic, by the way. They're not metal, so it's not like you're going to get burned. They're plastic. Got to make sure that thing clicks in there. There's another one. It does include the little um, tool there because it does have those little screws on the bottom. If for more security, you use a little tool to screw, screw it um, securely on. It does include a quick start guide. It has recipes and it has times for like the times for you to cook your meat on. The grease catcher, it is aluminum. I do put a aluminum foil on top of it just so it's easier for me to clean up and toss it down in the garbage. I'm right there. Um, he's showing you that you need to use a little tool to screw on the little pieces for the handles. I have no idea where it is now, but you use that. You can see on the handles, it says left and right. If you didn't know how to put it left and right easy to assemble because the only thing that you assemble is that just the handles that's it because the basket and the grill are removable for you to use I'm showing you there that it has that's the only instructions that the box included there's no other instruction just but that paper and inside of the book it also has everything that the description of all the items the grease catcher you see you slide it right on the back that one is the pellet container that's where you put the pellets inside of that aluminum little basket thing and you use the little plastic the black plastic cup to measure exactly how many pellets you need 
fill in the box, the smoke box and press wood fire technology and keep smoking. That's how it's the instructions basically. Every time you use pellets, you have to put you have to select the, the pellet ignition box. An ignition button. The little boss got There it goes in there. I was recording on my phone, so it's hard for me to record. Right there, I'm saying only included compatible Ninja Wood pellets, but it's not. My husband was looking at it while we were looking, while we were setting up, and they said you can use with anything. Wash your items first. Right there, it says step one, step two, step three. And then you can read it yourself. You can pause the video and then see it if you want to. Basically, it says put a foil on the thing, on the grease catcher for easy cleanup. Rem uh, put the little pellets on the container on the back. It says high, medium, and low. Press the wood fire flavor technology button. And then you're all good to go. Look at that. Those are that looks like dog food to be honest. You fill in your little measuring cup and then you fill in your little sidebar. Basically fills up all the way to the top. It's a good measuring cup. Don't lose it. After you wash all your items, make sure you put it before you start heating up the, the grill because you will need to heat it up before you actually add your food. We're going to do the smoker this time. It says off. Grill, smoker, air crisp, bake, roast, broil, and great, great. Hydrate, dehydrate. <laughs> and then wood fire flavor technology button. You press that. Every time you put the wood pellets, it'll you select your temperature, you select your time, and you're good to go. It'll start preheating and it'll tell you when you need to add your food and basically that's it. To preheat you have to put it on grill, press the technology button if you put pellets, temperature, the preheating time depends on if you put medium, low or high. We put high so it's 15 minutes. You select time here, then you press the stop, and ignition will start. When it's done, um, preheating, it'll say done, and then you can add your food and select whatever it is it that you want to do on the other side. Roast huh? beef. Goodbye, roast beef. You cook it for 15 minutes? Mm -hmm. You can smell the smoke. Uh, for all purpose blend, balanced, mild, bright, sweet. And while we were um, waiting for it to preheat, uh, my husband actually saw, found another video that you could use any kind of pellets, any kind of brand, any kind of, uh, it doesn't need to be uh ninja wood fire pellets it even it says only compatible with ninja wood fire pellets but you can put any Do you like the smoker? Yep. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <coughs> Ninja air fryer. We have it and that's what it was using in the past. Still using this now. Leaves the meat juicier. Mm-hmm. And of course the 
the taste of barbecue and the pellets. The meat is delicious. Are you eating both pieces? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> 10 out of 10? Mm -hmm. Recommend? Mm -hmm. Okay.